perfect game rankings all over the place. Guys with really good accolades, and there is a really good start right there. Breaking ball and trip nine chances at Coastal Carolina. So he did not mess up too often down there. Is that one? And now the 2-0 is nowhere near. Throw down to second as the runner tries to go is perfect. A one hopper that Neil's jabbing Bates in there for the payoff pitch. And it is hit out towards center. Robertson a few steps back, and now in his glove for out. And he'll go the other way with this one, a sinking line drive, but it'll hang long enough for Cherokee Nichols. Players, 3-2 pitch, change up hit sharply, but right where the second baseman was playing, and that will be an easy 4-3 put out for out number two. Joe is put together, 3-2 is off the plate. After an All-American freshman year, 0-2 is chopped right to the first baseman. It's bobbled, though, by Bush, and nobody's going to be able to make a play. Love tried to get over there and scoop it up, and he couldn't. Awaits a 3-1, and that one will miss down low. A walk. Ty Evans, very aggressive, lines one into left field. One run will score. Shelton around third, head for home. He's a brown-eyed, handsome man. And just like that, a two-out walk. Five to replace it. 3-2 to Dale is a slow roller to third, picked up by Clements. His throw on the run is in time, and that will strikeouts. Here's a chopper to short. Should be easy for Shelton, and it is for out number one. And Phil Pot will miss, so 2-2 two -two pitch. Grounder back up the middle, and that will sneak through. So Clements gets a slider and steers it right back. A 1-2 offering, hit hard down the first baseline. Cags knocks it down. He'll flip to a covering Alex Philpot, and that saved to try to get one of those here. The 2-2 pitch, and he got him. Good slider there from the freshman. Garrison ready for the 2-2, and he puts a little knock into that one. Deep fly to left. Ballpark will hold it, though, as Tyler Gertson will to a good start here in his sophomore year, and he goes the other way for another base hit. So they put the shift on him just like they did yesterday, and Robertson says, I can go to left. Need that. So he's in scoring position now for Curlin, but he won't get a chance as he get plunked with a breaking ball. Well, Cag's going after the first pitch, lines one into center field. Robertson around third, and he will score easily as the throw gets cuts off. So Jack Caglione did first as that one is popped up right behind the bag at second. McKinley barely has to move, and he will haul it in for out number two. back. Here's a 3-2 pitch, and it's a swing and a miss. So Love went deep in the count. Down the road, give you a tough left-on-left -left matchup with that windup he has. Yeah, a little funk to it, and this one has popped down the right field line. Caglione giving chase, and how about that Willie Mays catch? Then they've been able to do against Gator pitching. Well, he's going to get on. At least with a base hit, line drive right over the shortstop's head. It's not his fault nobody's on. His one-two is lined in the center again. So back-to-back -back singles by Runnels and Bush. Two-two pitch, got him. Chased a high fastball, but whatever. For him in this ball game. Comebacker though, right back to the freshman, and the underhand toss to Caglione will retire the side. Gets a breaking ball, hits it hard, and that will be off of the glove on the backhand an attempt by Clements. So the first hit of Tanner Garrison's Gator career is a double down the left field. 3 1 fastball is laced out in the left center field. That ball is down, and Garrison will be held up. Robertson trying to get to second, and he's going to be thrown out. That's a great job on the cutoff right there as the first baseman. Kate Bush came over, got himself at Florida in quite some time. Caglione will hit one right into the shift and right where the shortstop was playing. So he'll get thrown out as Alex Rodriguez was out into shallow right field. Certainly pitch. 3-1 just misses inside, and Heyman will trot down to first. 0-1. Nipped him. Starling tried to come in and got a little... Gets a slider and pulls it through the left side and the shift. One run will score. Here comes Heyman. He will score. And yet again, the Gators with some two-out damage as Tyler. 
There they go again on the 3 2, and that one is all the way to the backstop. And that's going to be a balk. You can't do that. Through to an occupied base. There's your balk. And the 2 1 is hit hard right into the shift, though. And Rodriguez will throw across in time to retire the side. So they do, but it ends up hitting them. That ball was almost a strike. 3 2 pitch, and that one is smacked out into the gap in left center field. It's down. Robertson will pick it up. And they're going to hold Nichols, but. Grounder to second, Curlin will handle it, but the Ospreys are going to get their first run as Clements with the RBI ground out. That ball is smacked down the left field line and fair. So the Ospreys are going to get another one as Gerdeson just took one the other way. He's got himself a double, and he's pumped. But he's going to go the other way, and that ball is going to fall. Evans will field it. Throw all the way to the plate, but it's not going to be in time. And a three shot here for the Ospreys. Coach in third. One two is a swing and a miss. And the one today. Two two pitch is strike three called. Good fastball down and in, and that froze Caglione. Here's a two two pitch and strike three again. So how about the freshman? He has sent down Caglione and Cags. He lost him. So after a couple of strikeouts, Shelton got jammed on that breaking ball. Leinenbach will try to run it down, but it'll be the left fielder, Gerdeson, cutting in front of him. He can hang a zero after the Ospreys just put up three, and that's a good way to start it. Few non Floridians. Here's a slow roller to Thomas. The bare hand play is not going to be in time. And despite 3 2 pitch is off the plate. And uh oh. Remember an opening weekend like that. That one's lined in the left field for a base hit. Looks like he tried to throw a change up in there and he hung it right out over the middle part of the plate. So Bates will come in to score with an opportunity, but he'll pop the first pitch up. Foul territory. Jack Caglione will drift over and haul it in to retire the side. That one misses. And Thomas will reach. Tanner Garrison the hitter and he'll roll one white to short Rodriguez has it flips it to McKinley but the throw is wide and that will prevent the double play and the one two is hit the other way again Robertson's ball is down and that one's going to get all the way to the wall Garrison round in third heading for home he's a brown eyed handsome man and a three hit night on an opposite field. That went out towards third, gobbled up by Clements, and his throw is in plenty of time. And then back to the Slater slider, and he'll get the Leinenbach, who's got an RBI single tonight. That one a fly ball to the new right fielder. It's Michael Robertson. He moved over, pitch away from retiring the side, and he's going to get it. Slater slider down in the dirt, and just like that, a couple of strikeouts and a quick with that big frame. Man, that one's not even close. So a leadoff walk as Fisher, really, really important. As Heyman can't check his swing on that one. He goes down in the dirt and strike. Here's Shelton, squares the bunt, and going against the shift, he's going to be rewarded with a base hit. So hitless tonight. Shelnut right off the end of the bat, finds the hole into right field. One run will easily score as Cags will step on home plate and a capper. Gives the Gators their ninth run of the game and Shelna. Here's a 3 2, and that plunked him. So he threw. They don't, and Dale's upset. He wanted to hit. Gets a fastball and smokes one. Line drive out to left. It'll be caught by Gerdeson. Deep enough to score Shellnut on the sack fly, so he's down on the count 0 2, and goes the other way again. A career high, four hits. Guy will step on the bag at third. He will score. Dale Thomas chugging along. There's going to be a play at the plate. No, it's dropped on the relay, and he will score. So how about Michael Robertson? 
Three two to Curlin fisted right off the end of the bat and that'll roll out to second and roll over to first to end. Neely with the off speed pitch it's grounded to Shelton and a perfect dart over to Caglione for out number one. Now the one two and see ya. Ninety five up away from winning and they'll get it. Neely gets a strikeout on the 94 mile an hour fastball and works a perfect ninth here to seal the deal on 